Hello, black women, black voters out there. I defy you to still tell me you're a Biden supporter after seeing this story coming up right after this. Men from France, politics, culture, religion, what is the vision? Welcome to Random Thoughts, Ray Sean Blyden here. Leave a like, share, and subscribe. I, I just can't believe, well actually yeah I can. I can definitely believe, it. I was gonna say I can't believe what I saw, but I've always known about his, when I say him, I mean President Biden's tendencies to not like, let's say, my skin tone hair. This is just sad. I, when I saw this, I literally felt empathy. I felt really bad for the young, young, young lady hair. It, it's really horrible what he did. I mean, she clearly, I, I can't tell, but I would say that she's not a voting age, which is a shame because if she's if she was a voting age, that definitely would be another black voter for Trump for sure. What he did to her was deplorable. And I defy you to tell me that this wasn't his racist tendencies coming out to Red's ugly head. Let's find it. Let's find it. Give me a second here. Okay. Let's go. I I want I'm gonna read this and then we're gonna watch the footage and I want you to really look at me in the face in the eyes and tell me that that was okay. Disgraceful behavior, rude elderly Biden. You forgot dementia-ridden racist Biden supporter appears to berate young. That's another thing. Don't you dare talk about us Trump supporters being unruly when you see what this lady did. But she the Biden supporter appears to berate the young black woman and then Joe Biden just blows her off, ignores her. And a picture is worth a thousand words, but the video is worth a million. And look, this is the, the, the woman. Look at her. Look at her, re her reaction. Wait until you see it. And then the one behind it. Yeah. He completely look at it. she. You'll see that she went from being happy, couldn't wait to take a selfie with the president or even a hug, maybe, which I, I advise you not to take a hug because you know this little sniffy sniffy. But um, she didn't get any of that. In a scene all too familiar to those who have witnessed the Democrat so called tolerance first-hand on incident occurred at a Biden campaign event Friday night in Madison, Wisconsin. After delivering a speech to his supporters, Biden proceeded to shake hands and take selfies with several audience members. Among the crowd was a young black woman excited and proudly holding a Biden-Harris sign. And she was. You'll see it. However, her moment of joy was rudely interrupted by an elderly Biden supporter who seemed visibly irate. And you'll see she was. She was definitely irate. To make matters worse, Biden himself added insult to the injury because the young woman was disappointed when Biden ignored the young woman entirely walking past her without as much as a glance. Democrats preach unity and respect, but fail to practice what they preach. Let's watch this together, folks. I'm going to put the audio on mute and I'll just commentate it because it's just playing music. It's not really, and I don't know if this music is copywritten, so let's, uh, let's mute that. I'll just tell you what's happening. So Biden is taking selfies with everyone. The young black woman is getting her phone ready. She's beaming. She's smiling. Uh-oh. Someone to her right there. She's drilling her down. 
She's giving it a look. She's grabbing her sign and telling her, get that sign out of my way. Girl, what are you doing? And she's, I don't know what she's saying, but the conversation is heating up. It's heating up. She's yelling at the black girl, visibly angry now. She said something. I can't read lips. Anyone can read lips? Tell me what they're saying there. I can only imagine what they're talking about. And now she's visibly upset, this young woman. She is fit. Look at her face. She does not look happy anymore. Okay, she's smiling now. She's thinking the president, she's going to get her moment. Okay, the president took a look. He, she said hi, and he completely ignored her. Oh, man, that is so cold. That's cold-blooded. He completely ignored her. That is cold-blooded. Wow. So let's see what people are saying on X about this. So someone named John Curtis, he uh, Xed or tweeted, I, I can't get used to saying X. Smitten black girl rejected by Biden, who, who instead stopped to take selfies with old, angry white woman. And she was. She was dead. Okay, we're not going to play the music, but yeah. It's worth looking at again. So he takes a, a selfie with her. She says, hi. He completely ignored her. Wow, that is so bad. I feel so bad for her. I, I really do. I, I really feel bad. Ian Miles, he said, I'm embarrassed for this black girl. I, I do. I am too. She thought Biden was going to give her a hug, but he just skipped past her and moved on to the white woman. I felt bad for her too. It was, it was bad. Someone else said here, I mean, therefore I am says, Oh, the moment she realized those stories about Biden not wanting to integrate with black people were actually true. For those of you who uh, don't know about that, his past, you need to look it up. He did not want, I, I did an episode, episode about that. Did not want, what did he call it, a jungle or racial jungle or something? He didn't want black people to integrate with the white people is, is what he he didn't want. Someone, Joey Manorino says, racist Joe Biden rejects a selfie with the only black girl in the crowd, but happily takes one with every white in the crowd. Could you imagine if this was Donald Trump, the stories that would be going on? Could you just imagine that? I mean, seriously. I'm, I'm curious to know what you all think about that because it is really deplorable. Isn't even the word for it. It's, just, it's horrible. It, it really is. I feel really bad for the young woman. I would love to know if she's of age to vote and if she's of age to vote, who she's voting for. I just want you to take a look at this picture right here. Coming up. Hold on, where's that picture? Let's gotta get rid of this. Right here. If a picture is a thousand words. I just want you to take a good look at that. Look at at the people that Trump surrounded himself with on the bottom and look at Biden on the top. Who's the racist now? Who is the racist now? I really feel bad for the young woman. So I wanted to get this out there before I get myself ready for church. Happy Sunday. I usually don't do videos on Sundays, but I just felt this was important enough where I had to do it. This has to get out there, especially for the, if you know a young black woman or a black woman, you need to show her this video, share this video, like this video, share it so it can spread out. And we're still doing the giveaway, obviously. We're still doing the, uh, if you, um, I can't remember right now. My brain, I'm so hungry. I haven't even had breakfast yet. I just felt I had to jump right in here. Once I took my dogs out on a run, I saw this video. I was like, no, they say it ain't so, Joe, but it is so. It is definitely so. So anyway, leave a like, share, and subscribe. The when we get to a certain number, I can't think of the number right now. For I think it's 
I said what uh, right now we're at 1400 so 2400 I think we'll do a giveaway anyway leave a like share and subscribe share this with any black woman that you know this needs to be shown to them if they really want to vote for this guy random thoughts politics